We're gonna see if this works. I'm not exactly sure if this game will run or not, but I seen it was uh, laying around on GOG. So I thought to myself, you know, hey, screw it. I haven't played uh, John Woo Stranglehold in a long time, and I felt like going back to revisit it since it just happened to be in the store. I mean, for anybody who's not familiar with um, Stranglehold, it was a probably the only sequel, I guess, John Woo ever did to um, did to his classic film Hard Boiled. I mean, probably a lot of people are going to be you know, familiar, but it's probably one of the most badass. Is for the crave. One of the most badass uh, action movies of probably at least my top ten for you know films of all time. I mean, I don't remember the game being. Don't remember the game being too too good because I think it's not a solid sequel to the uh, the first film. But I still think it was kind of neat that uh, that John Woo even optioned it for um, a video game, which was always kind of neat. Let's uh, type in a few tags here. Hopefully it runs. I have not checked yet. I should, but I'm not going to. I usually like to do it the day of. Because... Because I'm a rebel like that. Hopefully they have the tags for it around here. I like how it's just called Stranglehold, even though the original title is, you know, has John Woo's name in the beginning of it, but it is what it is. I'll just dig this game up and see if it'll capture the screen. It should though, I've never had any problem with the screen capture features of this. Okay, so it is on the screen. It's just shrunk to a ridiculously small size. <laughs> Let's see, where's the... Uh... Let's transform it. Fit the screen. And then turn it back on. Midway presents in association with Tiger Hill Entertainment. They even use the classic, like, washed-out white lettering that the old, uh, films used to be known for. Chicago. Ooh. I mean, it has a lot of the trademark John Woo stuff that, you know, he's, Woo's known for, which is, you know, shootouts. The graphics, of course, look questionable at this, you know, period, and... and gaming. Check the monitoring it because I don't want the audio to get overpowered, which is always the biggest pain with this type of stuff is making sure the audio is, you know, functionally okay. Okay. Hear my audio, but uh, yeah. okay, that sounds fun. Let's bring it back up. Yeah, 
sounds, sounds okay. Settings. Obviously, I don't think there are many that have video settings, but uh, just decals and stuff like that. I think there might be. S I don't know. Should I change the resolution? Uh, no. I think the original resolution is probably whatever the PlayStation 3 put out. So I don't fucking feel like fucking around with that. Let's turn it on. Not normal. I used to love playing the online for this. It was. <laughs> It, it was, was hilarious. hilarious. Let's, Let's just, just say, say that the, uh, the, the multiplayer, multiplayer was was funny. I remember some kid cried, cried when I beat his ass, when I beat the brakes off of him in multiplayer. Which I thought was pretty hilarious. I think he, uh, he was crying because uh, I wouldn't let him win. One man. It's a trap, Captain. I walk in there, my cover's blown. And there'll be two missing cops. Relax, everybody. This guy doesn't give us orders. I'm not sending in one man. I'm sending in a whole SWAT team. No, you are not. You're not giving orders either, Tequila. We got a missing cop. And only one lead. You send in a SWAT. The lead dies or disappears. One guy'd be crazy to go in there. You used to be that crazy guy, Jerry. What happened? Not if I Jerry. was that missing cop, I hope one of us would want to go. Don't send anyone, Captain. They just get in my way. Tequila, don't. It's a setup. I hope so. I hate to think they were wasting our time. Tequila, get back here! I mean, so out of character for this, uh... Well, I mean, he is kind of a brazen asshole, but... It seems out of out of character for that dialogue set up. Like, I'm pretty sure he would already be lost his job. Oh my god, it's a car. Careful, Tequila. This is a rough neighborhood. Press space bar to dive and press the left mouse button to shoot. Tequila time will engage automatically when you aim at enemies while diving. So basically, it's like this. It's not the worst control game, but you can tell it's almost like a midway game. I don't know why I would want to invert the camera, but... Pretty fast pace though, it fits the, uh, you know. Information, press your back seats button, whatever. I ah, I'm just gunning at nothing.
give a man a gun, he's Superman. Give a guy a gun, he's Superman. Give him two, he's God. Yes, these are uh, important little details. I think this was made by the same company that um, I'm pretty sure is Vin Diesel's company. Because I, I think there's a trailer for uh, his Wheelman game that was in here. You know, his, <laughs> his poorly received Wheelman game. I mean, it runs nice, though. I mean, there's a few frame rate stutters here and there for a PS3 game on PC, but... It's got a lot of the trademark John Woo shooting, like the tea house scene. I kind of wish John Woo would actually go back to the same genre, but he's just kind of been noodling around with, like, uh, some other stuff. I think the last film I've seen of his was The Battle for Red Cliff. Second dead cop. <sighs> Combat's not too fluid, but that's fine. I keep forgetting I can engage uh, the whole time without having to. Uh... So they actually got a nice style down for this game, but it came out it very fast. I 
And if everybody's wondering why it looks like Max Payne, it's because Max Payne pretty much drew a lot of its, um, a lot of its influence from the classic John Woo films, because John Woo pretty much set the whole tragic hero, tr like, trend of at least the ones everybody remembers, like, the Better Tomorrow, uh, Hard Boiled the Killer, oh, yeah, this is the, uh, the Easter Egg. Alright. Yeah. That's how I know it's a Vin Diesel video, uh, produced video game. Because his game trailer's in it. You'll see what eventually, what the, um, what those cranes are used for. They're used for, you know, specials. Let's see. Which we'll get to that, I think, in an, another section of this game. Ah, oh, yes, the uh, standoff. You are in a stand up. You have to take out the enemies one at a time by aiming with mouse, shooting with left mouse button. Dodge their shots with A and D. Keep an eye out for glints. Because you get dodged. Bolts and mouse. Of destruction. Okay, a little frame rate stuttering there, but at least it works. Yeah, now it tells you you can exit and enter and exit the, the tequila mode. I'm like, dude. Introduction to what the cranes do as you unlock them. <laughs> Just for like stuff like this. <laughs> Crotch shots never get tiring. I 
guy I've already getting shredded by a shotgun, but... Golden pistols. Gotta love it. Oh, another standoff. Who killed the cop? Go to Taiyo and ask an I-9. But be quick. There won't be any left after tomorrow. It had to have been fun for them at least, you know, getting to do this. Oh, no, there's the gold guns. Golden guns might come in handy. Tequila. It's Lee. Cherry's got info on a deal going down at the tea house. Golden Cane run the place. Which is why I want you to wait until I can send backup. Sorry, Captain. I just got a personal invitation. Tequila! Look at that crane. Can never have enough cranes. Okay, I'm stuck behind something. Okay, uh, no. Oh, wait, that might be nice. Drop that uh, down. Oh, fell off again. Tequila doesn't like walking in straight lines. Or taking the stairs, for that matter. It's very buggy in here. Frame rate drops. Nah. Of course, they had to pick a tea house for the first part, because that's how Hard Boil kicks off is a tea house. I remember when this game came out, though, it just looked fantastic. <laughs> and there's the John Woo's cameo. You're the only one who does. Tayo, baby. How come he's still not dead? We ran out of shooters. Why don't you go down and try? You still got a shooter on you, boy. The Imperial Nine deal is going down right now at the center table. Ah. Keep tequila on that bar stool. That guy's golden suit. <coughs> <coughs> Extra flamboyant. Passports. Too light. You're short. Wong agreed to the amount. Now, do you have the passports or not? I don't give a damn what Wong agreed to. This is an I-90. Ooh. 
It's a 9-9 deal, buddy. There's a shootout to be had. Tequila wants in. Got heat at the bar. You brought a cop to our deal? <laughs> Jesus. I mean, this is all action fact. The thing I like about it is it's actually got a nice fluid flow of combat versus cutscene, but it blends it really nice. Doors ain't opening to one of us is dead. Looks like uh, one of us is dead, apparently. <laughs> if you want to open that door, uh, feel free. Save the golden guns just for that. I told you not to go in alone. Which I have no I doubt those are a reference to. Uh, this is what our need wanted us to find. But it's probably a reference to uh, John Woo's other movie, the um, uh, Face the Off, that he did the, the US market. Muscle. Wong's got the ionized healing cops and dealing passports to Golden Cane. Except the deal went bad. Someone's trying to start a war. We better stop him. I'm heading down to Dio. I'm gonna shake some cages and see what falls out. Like hell you will. Tayo's not your turf and you know it. That's an ongoing narcotics probe. We have it under control. Drug gangs, turf wars, and a dead cop. And you call that under control? Watch your step, Tequila. You go out of bounds, you'll lose your badge. Oh, God. Please don't take my badge, please. Look, I did uh, $8 million worth of damage in China, which that's probably translates to about five U.S. dollars. Made in China. $8 million worth of damage. I like how even the uh, the uh, out you know normal characters look like they're gang members too because we reuse some of the character models. If they do this to a cop, what won't they do to you? Imperial Nines come to collect today, and Mr. Wong's boat. It came this morning. But the Golden Cane are trying to take control of this place. Poor guy. His big thumb. Snipers fucking hate him. Oh 
Oh, who's up there? <sighs> yeah, like I want a fucking shotgun. Get out of here with that crap. Tequila, it's Jerry. I heard you were heading to Tayo. Keep your eyes open for Golden King drug labs and take them out if you Meth find labs. Them. You knew how this was gonna end. No, oh, okay, so there's a lot of areas I kinda missed. Oh, I thought I could pick those up. Oh wait, I can. Okay, let's stick with this then. Ah, God. <coughs> Frame rate really drops inside of buildings for this. Which I'm still grateful it's on here, but, you know. Okay, time to blow up this meth lab. Spectre tequila don't want none of that meth. Got that, but I see some meth smoke coming out of here, so meth smoke it is. Destroy the map. Okay, how the hell do I get that? Do I just go in? I guess so. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, what the hell? Cold cocked him anyway, laid him out flat. Says there's some meth labs in there. Back of the head, and he did that. Bye. Right, Johnson. Come with me, and you'll be in the world of imagination where you'll be free. Let's get rid of a lot of these math labs. Can't have that shit mucking up Kowloon, can I? What? Why didn't I activate my super sweet time? Oh, okay. I have to destroy all the drug labs? Where are they hiding? I thought we eliminated every single one of those crummy drug labs. Well, I 
guess we could always go up there and... Okay, so where's the last drug lab? Oh, there it is. It's right in front of us. How did I miss it? No clue. Okay, there's smoke coming out of that drug lab. Now, how do I get to it? Come with me and you'll be in a world of pure mess imagination. Well, it shows it right there. I'm just not exactly sure where this meth lab is hiding. Like an Ow! Oh, right there. Maybe it's... I just thought it was an arts and crafts table or something, maybe. Methamphetamine arts and crafts. Come with me, give me bullets. Press space bar, space bar, space bar to mount the zipline. You can slow down and speed up on zipline and pressing. Okay, yeah, we get that. I mean, I've never seen a man grip a wire with his bare hands before and make it look like his fingers aren't being set afire. Okay. Fuck are those the Vietnam Chinese? Viet Cong? Come with me and you'll be in a world of your imagination where you'll be free. <laughs> Want to view paradise and look around and view it. You wanna change the world and do it. Now we're into another uh, exciting town here. A shanty town, no less, but I like it. I can't wait to make the wallpaper for this. It should turn out better than my Narcosis one, that's for sure. Up. Oh. Trademark. Trademark doves. That's barrage mode. Barrage is a beast. You will find that it destroys a lot of environments. Uh, uh, 
I know. Unfortunately, we just had a, a bunch of vacancies clear up in the old shanty town of okay. I mean, granted, this looks better than where I'm living, but... Jesus, not by much. Kind of set it up so you can kind of approach these as you would if you were trying to stylize the whole thing. Oh, my, uh, whoop. Not exactly sure where you came from, but I, uh, sure as hell know where you're going. Straight into the ground. Come with me, and you'll be. Give me that fucking dove. Oh, wait. There we go. Yeah. It gets a bit stuttery, but I'm probably sure that's just the uh, issue with uh, porting games over from consoles. Because I don't think this was on PC originally, as far as I remember. But, you know, God bless them for uh, porting it. Because you don't get the option to play much of these games anymore. I mean, you get 40,000 rematches in the game from last year. But you won't be able to even get them on. That's actually worth the damn. I don't even know where that guy is. Let's back out for a second. Bob. Okay, so we did the meth labs in, as far as I can see. Ah. Ah, so there's a barrel. from the choir back there. I don't know why there would be a TV back there, but... I don't see any more meth labs down here. I'm, I don't want to say I'm sure, but I'm almost pretty sure. I destroyed all the meth labs down here. I am a hero. <clears throat> I've cleaned up the city. <laughs> it's definitely a meth lab. That's one of the dangers of working a meth lab right there, ladies and gentlemen. If you get uh, even a stray bullet in it, it's just gonna blow the hell up and kill you.
Could be opium, but I'm pretty sure it's meth. Destructible environments, my favorite. Gangbusters, baby. Ah, oh, fuck it. Let's try those bad boys out. Tequila could use a little bit of, uh, firepower here. Tequila, Jerry here. Heads up, Golden Cane's got a gunboat coming to Tayo to be <coughs> Don't get caught in the crosshairs. No, I plan on getting caught in the circle squares. Squircle hitters. <laughs> See, this game has so much destruction. It was just a nice, fun little game to play. So I don't think a lot of people bought it when it came out, which I personally think is tragic as hell, but... Even the music's great though. It's actually it, like it, it, you know, elicits that uh, that John Woo hardboiled vibe. You know, like, like the old movies that you don't see in the Chinese cinema, or Asian cinema. Tequila time. Tequila! Ba -da 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 -ba -ba -da -da. Okay. any meth labs out here. There's a crane out here. last time. Unfortunately, I fried myself on uh, <laughs> destroying meth labs.
I don't even know how you can scream out after being shot in the throat, but... No doubt. Okay, let's get up here, I guess. Okay, I guess I can reach it from over here. I'm sitting here like, how do I get over there? Shot, one kill! I'll grab him in the meth lab. Great place to be. Okay, now that we got it out of this meth lab, where do I go? How was that? Um, excuse me, get up on top of this. Let's go to that meth house over there. He's probably underneath me, but I don't even care. He's not even bothering me. Okay, here we go. Triggers a cutscene. Fucking uh, image there. Hmm. Should have checked that earlier, I guess. Uh, I think it's just because Streamlabs really does not like. I'll probably have to delete it and re upload it later. Hmm. I probably could get away with redoing 